And we are back, ladies and gentlemen. More Rocket League action here on your screen as we go to the Academy League. The Shadow versus, get the hashtags ready in the chat, the Wolves. Ladies and gentlemen, we got a great matchup between these two teams. And the, the Shadow overcame a big obstacle early on in the playoffs, whereas the Wolves, they've kind of been the boogeyman of the Blue Conference so far. Uh, classy any insight at all i mean i'm looking at the quarterfinals right now and these both seem like powerhouse teams you talked to me uh between the break just uh, who's on the wolves team and what they've been doing just throughout the regular season uh the stats is just ridiculous of these two players above 50 percent as far as shot to goal ratio i'm talking like every other shot they make i mean stats there it's just a number but that definitely can lend itself to amazing play and i'm hoping to see a lot of it here today and baby Northwest, I tell you what, he showed off in the previous round. I I remember seeing and hearing his name every single play. It, it almost seemed like he was everywhere on the pitch. So the shadow, I feel like they're going to be equal to the task against the Wolves here. But uh, 26 and 13 for the Wolves, the shadow 24 and 14. But the Wolves, one of the best offenses and defenses in the Academy League. So the stats very much in the Wolves' favor here. But once the you get on the pitch, it, everything can change. Yeah, you never know. Stats are just a number. Uh, these two teams looking to make their name in the MLE Hall of Fame it's single elimination. So they got to come out stronger than they ever have up to this point. Able to, I'd say not easily, but definitely commandingly make it through quarterfinals. But these two teams are powerhouses. We're going to have to see who advances to the conference finals. Well, we will get underway here on lovely Utopia Coliseum as we get that overview one more time. We are underway in game number one. Baby Northwest differential for the Shadow. Eric and Samurai for the Wolves. As Eric going to push this ball in. Great 50-50. We'll keep it in the Shadow zone. Baby Northwest. We'll try to bring it in 50-50. The Wolves trying to pin the Shadow in their own zone early. Here is the Wolves as differential. Able to get by one, not able to get by Eric in the net. Very patient was Eric as he's going to push this all the way down. This will be a nice ball. Samurai has time. Chooses not to go for it. Differential will come out and Samurai will push it under. Good interference. A little bit of a team bump right there. The Wolves going to give up the play here. Samurai gets the ball first shot towards the net. Off the post and out. I think that was the best shot he could have made. It was going to get saved, cleared out by differential, but either way, that post means it's going to bounce to the side and stay in. And that means a counterattack from Samurai, able to keep it in that black box, stuff differential with this clear, and then play it with this shallow angle. Well done to get over the defender. Yeah, very nicely done. The angle, not one that you'd expect here in the Academy League, but he executed it extremely well. First goal on the board for the Wolves. Face off, we'll go to the shadow. Differential, not gonna control this ball very well. Eric gonna put a little bit of a howitzer missile towards the backboard, as this is just being shelled off the backboard right now. Samurai once again off the backboard. Differential finally will see it out, but three touches off the backboard as the Wolves. Looks like they're gonna aim there, Classy, and I, I don't blame them. At this level, it's a very susceptible spot. Oh yeah, backboard defense is huge. Something you learn a little bit later, and it's very hard to get down because in two v twos you got one person in net, and maybe one person challenging. You don't have enough men, I guess, to, to spare having someone up high on the backboard. So if you can play it off that, maybe get some passes either the side or the back. This could be great for setting up some goals here for the Wolves. 
Northwest. We go back to two wolves and a baby Northwest. The differential, we'll find out as he takes it into the corner. Eric takes control. Waits for the boost. Good patience here. He's going to try to see it by baby Northwest. Does so half decently. As differential going to clear this ball out of the corner. Baby able to get the 50-50 and that'll contain control for the shadow in the Wolves zone. Missed by Eric and everyone missing all together as the shadow miss out on an opportunity. Yeah, they need to start turning those in. At least put a threatening shot on net even if it might be right at the defender or easily saved. If you can make them make a move toward the ball not let them have that time to make a nice easy clear or one to their offender maybe get that transition just catching this wolves defense like off guard and, and, and making sure they make plays on the ball and they don't get kind of in your face and the wolves playing very passively right now is baby northwest gonna have a shot opportunity but not able to get it towards the net easy clear away by eric who's gonna take control here 50-50 differential, well done. Samurai now has a chance, but not able to follow it. Runs out of boost. It'll be a ball towards the middle. Differential, long touch. Is able to get a second one after the clear. Just a lot of back and forth. Now an opportunity for the Wolves. Eric is going to put this off of the net. And uh, Really, a missed opportunities have been the name of the game so far. The Shadow going to try to create their own opportunities, though, with the demo play. Yeah, I'm seeing shots that could be put on net, but they're going a little to the side. Those right there even could have been taken a little bit slower. Both sides, both teams seem to be susceptible to it, but I think the Wolves are okay with this. They've got the lead. Not the biggest one. you got a minute left with a one-goal differential. You can score at any time you want. But if they're maintaining pressure, make sure the ball doesn't hang out on their side too, too long. I think they're sitting fairly good and able to hold on to try to take this game one. Well, here is Samurai. Differential, easy stop. 50-50 win. The Shadow really sticking with the ball right now, not letting the Wolves have too much control. Samurai will put it down into the Shadow zone. Eric now with a shot towards the net. Baby Northwest keeps it corner. Nice touch off of the corner as Eric going to drop it for Samurai. Differential now, taking control in the wall zone, will miss the shot opportunity completely. It's 2v1 back the other way. Eric with a chance, baby Northwest though. Stalwart in the net. That was clutch right there. Could have sealed the game off. We've got 10 seconds though. Shadow, if they want to do anything, it's got to be happening right now. Keep that ball on the blue side, push that. We only got three seconds left, keep it in the air. It's their goal right oh, now. Oh, and here's a chance if baby can get it. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> The, that was in that was in on my screen i thought the shadow had made the comeback and they turned this ball around but wow why you gotta play with me like that <laughs> oh my goodness that one was close no. and if you're a wolves fan you breathe a sigh of relief that is so cruel oh man <laughs> that that ball I'd say a sixth of it was out. It hit the ground. That arch just was a hair too low. Uh, there was even a cherry picker play that, that could have happened, but I think it was the smartest option not to touch it because it was already going on net. But there's nothing you can do about that. You're going to think maybe I should have hit a little harder, but just don't worry about it. You got to go into the next game, Shadow. Shake it off. You kept it a one goal differential and almost tied it up right at zero seconds. I think you can do that again, but this time maybe get some more points on the board, get that offense moving a little bit uh, more heavily to challenge the Wolves. I 100% agree with you here because uh, the Wolves almost seemed like a little bit of a boogeyman coming in with their goal differential being the best in the Academy League. And the Shadow looked really good against this Wolves team. I'm not sure if the Wolves didn't come into their own or if the Shadow just weren't allowing them to do so. But if you're a member of the Shadow, you got to be thinking, hey, we got a chance right now against a really good team in the Wolves as they will look to keep it close here in game number two differential brings it into the corner he's got that wonderful wonderful weed trimmer boost as this ball is going to drop in the box but eric will keep it out it's wonderful defense there by eric able to get up faster than everybody else 
It's just not only hanging out in the box, but just in the area right above the crossbar. Keep it there and higher. That's what Garrett needs to do. He needs him to add a whole lot of boost in the tank able to do just that. The defense from Wolves coming out strong. We've seen this all season long. And so far, Shadow hasn't been able to get a single one, so I think they're looking pretty good. Yeah, good continued pressure here by the Shadow. They're trying to keep the ball away from any dangerous positions. A touch towards the net, Samurai able to make the save and it's been really good defensive rotation the name of the game for the wolves so far as they continue to just make sure that they have a man back ready for an errant shot differential now we'll try to push it on this is gonna drop in the box samurai will manage to get it out baby northwest on his way in was looking for a goal big clear now by differential Differential gonna push this towards the net, but Eric is there and once again the Wolves not allowing the opportunities to take place. There just hasn't been that much danger out of the offensive zone of the Shadow. Yeah, but still it's staying on that blue half. This isn't something we've seen so far. I mean, game one didn't have it a whole lot. It seemed like the Wolves got in the lead at the beginning and just kept pushing the Shadow defense, but so far I mean, no threatening shots on the other side, but these are just long clears all the way to the other side. And this one's going to be off the woodwork and in differential, able to get a clear from midfield and turn it into a goal. Yeah, the pinch off of Samurai right there, and it ended up working out once again. And it, it seems like this might be the strategy for the Shadow going forward because they are able to find the net when the Wolves are not in their own zone. So... Maybe you want to try to stretch out your control a little bit, stretch the Wolves' defense a little bit. Yeah, that'd be the strategy right now. It seems like they're doing just fine how it is. They survived two minutes and the lead. They can keep this up, or if the Wolves can't figure anything out, it's going to be a tied-up series. Ball still in the blue zone. Baby Northwest will put it in the mid. Samurai. Long clear to differential. Differential hop hops it high. Eric's going to miss out. Samurai going to go for it here. This will be a ball off of the backboard. Baby Northwest there to defend. Samurai jukes Eric. Here's a chance for differential if he can get around it. He's going to take it all the way up the wall. It'll be touched by Samurai down. Chance. Baby Northwest not able to get there. Did not have the proper angle, but I like the bump play from differential there. Oh, yeah. Just being aggressive. You can't get that demo. Get the bump. Get them out of that play. I've been noticing a few times communication doesn't seem to be as key for the Wolves. But as I say that, that's going to be a counterattack and an open net. The Samurai tie it up for the Wolves. And that one's just going to be an easy 50-50 in midfield. Pushed up a little too high. You see that happen occasionally on 2v2s. Don't kick yourself for it. But that's a goal the Wolves were def desperately looking for. Man, oh man, as they tie it up. 2.07 on the clock. So we know we need at least one more goal in this game for us to move forward. Baby Northwest going to push it towards the net. Eric equal to the task. Demo play. Eric able to push through. He's going to back it off to Samurai. A great pass play in the offensive zone. Sees the Wolves score. There's that teamwork. Chemistry able to get that 50-50 and then see his teammate pops it in the opposite direction, but right in the path of Samurai's car. That's the stuff the Wolves we haven't seen as of yet, but right now it seems like they're coming alive. And just like that, they turn around. Two goals in the lead for the blue team. Baby Northwest off the kickoff, gonna try to control it, not able to do what he would like with it. Differential, the push out, just over the head of Eric. Differential's gonna try to take control here, contesting physically with Samurai. Ball lofted for Baby Northwest. He'll get it up and by. Differential and Baby both up. They need something here or to push it away and keep control. They do very well to make sure there was not a counterattack goal by the Wolves. Instead, Eric will bring it back. 1v1 opportunity. Good touch, but nobody home. And Baby Northwest will take control. Differential with the clear. Yeah, but it's that pressure. Seemed like a total turnaround at that two-minute mark. Wolves somehow figured out what they were doing wrong or, or maybe what Shadow was doing right and they needed to fix. Get that pressure up a little bit more and, and like we saw in game number one, I think they're just gonna hold this out, not push too much. They've got the lead and that's all they need in the last 45 seconds. 
Samurai he tries to clear it out. Differential to keep it in. Eric, plenty of time to control it in his own corner. Not very smart to bring it towards your own net, though, as Differential charged on. Almost got a really nice angle on that. That's a long ball. A chance now if Eric can take the shot on. He does so. But Differential just barely able to recover. Yeah, they're holding on right now. Shadow is the last thing they want is to get scored on. But the first thing, priority, is to get this one in. It gets it past one. This one's a slow one. Eric can't barely get to that one. In the last 10 seconds going the other way not looking too hopeful that's an open net and the, the nail in the coffin eric puts that one it's going to be wolves taking game two and looking at match point to take the series yeah the wolves really just allowing the shadow to come at them uh very eerily similar to what the pirates were doing to the dodgers in our previous game and, and it's amazing to see how this defensive outlook has turned into what has really been oppression for the opposing team as the shadow I, I don't know if they know what they need to do right now i don't know if i know what they need to do right now because they, the wolves just seem to have their answer at all times anytime the shadow get a shot on there's always someone there yeah, it's that confidence on the defensive side. I think with the Wolves uh, strategy, at least in that game, I can't really comment on the first one just because they took it and were able to play defense the whole time. But in that case, Shadow got the lead, but the Wolves were able to stay patient. Uh, they said, we're going to let the Shadow keep coming at us, but we're going to get those clears. And it eventually resulted in a long clear from a 50-50 that resulted in the, the tie of the game. And then uh, the third goal to see that I was also a clear. They're, they're realizing, uh, except for that second goal, they don't need to capitalize a whole lot of their offensive pushes. It's just maintain that defense. Let Shadow come at you because a lot of their pushes, uh, uh, especially on the corner, aren't too smart. They're, they're going shots and they're making the Wolves make a save. But every single time it's not too threatening and they don't have to move a whole lot and the clears are coming in clutch whenever they need to and the pressure is not really there. Yeah, and the other thing, we talked about the shot the shot differential, their shot percentage, a conversion percentage there, 57% for Eric on the season, Samurai, 50%. And in that game, three shots, three goals. So this is a Wolves team. They're doing exactly what they planned on doing, and they're doing it well. Can they finish it off in game number three, or will the Shadow make a comeback try? We find out as game number three underway. Differential going to win this one for the Shadow. Well, nice pinches. That is just wide to the right. Very close for the Shadow. As this might go back the other way. Eric, plenty of time. See if he can get around it. Nice shot towards the net, but Differential there to save. This aggression might cost him a little bit. Shadow should be careful. I mean, you should take advantage of those opportunities the Wolves are giving you, especially if you see a hole. You don't see that very often in the blue side on the defensive part, but... If you overcommit too much, we've seen the long clears transition. They're not too strong on. So I think Shadow should be careful from here on out. Here is Baby Northwest. Oh, Differential also committed to that. It's an opportunity, but it almost drops in. I thought for sure the Wolves were going to clear that, but they weren't able to do so, and that somehow stays out of the net. That was going to be nutty. Baby Northwest looking to get some style points there. I mean, differential being called off because they was like, I got this shot. It bounces off the corner and out. That's that's a 50-50. You never know if it's going to go in or out. In that case, not in the shadow's favor, but they know that's an opportunity that the Wolves just weren't able to say. So if they get another one just like that here a little bit later, that can be the lead for them. Good alleviation of pressure there as Baby Northwest is going to push this ball back into the wolf zone. Eric. Does not control it well. This is going to be a high ball off of the backboard. Here comes Baby Northwest. Misses a big opportunity. Back the other way we go. Samurai with the physical play and differential somehow makes the save on Eric. That one was close. Wolves had two offenders looking for the demo and then just the open net. But differential able to dodge both and get contact on the ball. That's your one job as the defender in that case. He does it perfectly able to keep it out of his own net and we're about to hit the three minute mark and no one has scored shadow needs to get on the board fast if they're looking for this reverse sweep i tell you what they're definitely trying as uh, most of these touches have been in that blue zone once again baby northwest gonna try to control this in gets an interesting pinch this might go back to the other way but it won't middle samurai with the push on 
Eric to retain the pressure here. Baby Northwest controls in his corner. Up the wall he goes. He's going to let it fall down. Gets it past Eric. And a 50 on Samurai keeps it in the mid. Differential. This is a shot towards the net off the backboard. He'll go high around, clear by Samurai. Differential there to interfere. Nice touch middle for Eric. Eric, the 50-50 win is going to keep this ball in the box. Another lofty touch is a chance for Samurai. Ball down. Baby Northwest Spider-Man's that ball away. The Shadow keep the ball and keep the game a goose egg. That had to be Bobby Northwest. No one else was going to be there. Differential had the boost deal and was at zero in net. He's like, I can't do anything. Help me out here, Bobby. So he comes off the back wall, able to get that save. That was lower shot, a little bit slower, but able to get there. Well done by Shadow. Staying alive, they need to make all of these saves and quite a few more. We still got about a minute and a half left. And uh, they need to get on the board is their priority right now. But keeping it out, it seems to be a struggle right now. I mean, they've maintained it at 0-0, but these are getting harder and harder shots to block, and eventually I think the Wolves can be able to get one in the back of the net. Here is a lofted touch. Differential will miss. Baby Northwest will take it all the way out to the right side. 1v1 potential. Baby's gonna get it by. Can it go in? It will. one to nothing. A shadow score first. That dirty little bop. Didn't hit it hard. Didn't hit it fast. Just hit it high and right above him. Didn't even go too much it's just faking out that defender saying where do you think i'm going i'm not going there i'm going above you well done with that 1v1 shadow needs to take advantage of those opportunities so right now the name of the game is survive for shadow if they can do that they're looking at game four here is eric has an opportunity it's going to be a miss baby northwest wide open net can he put it in yes he can two to nothing the game broken open yeah, it seems like the Wolves got a little too eager too soon. They had a whole minute to work on that equalizing goal, and yet they give it up right here with an easy clear from differential. And the cherry pick and play, Bobby was already at midfield, ready for that clear. And since both offenders were committed on the blue side, it was an open net for him to shoot at. And this is what Shadow was desperately looking for all series, and they finally got it here in game three. See if they can keep this going. There is a chance for the Wolves, and Samurai will convert here even though it took him a couple shots on this. Yeah, this is the first one though. They needed it. Shadow's not looking too happy about it, but the dunk, we see this all the time. Samurai, first goal of this game, for his team in fact, but he came alive last one. Let's see if they can transfer this into a few more. They've got a minute, it's definitely possible. Shadow looking to shut them down though. Long ball, Baby Northwest to Samurai. Samurai with the control, but differential will interfere. Eric. Lofts it into the corner. Nice 50-50 touch. This might drop in the box. Differential is up. Samurai gets the touch, but it'll go to the corner. Baby Northwest is there. Eric interferes quickly. Not able to get the 50-50 he was looking for. 26 seconds. Now Differential gets it by Eric with a huge demo in the box. We'll keep this pressure off. 17 seconds left, and the Wolves will try to put something on. Samurai carries it past Baby Northwest. That's a shot on off the bar and out so close. And that might be the opportunity that they miss. Samurai, he had one shot, either that or the center to Eric. Neither one of them work. And that's going to mean Shadow squeak by with a 2 1 victory. They needed it. This was match point for Wolves. So if there's any time to come and clutch, now is it. But it was close right there at the end, especially the Wolves definitely could have stolen that one away and gone into overtime. Who knows what would have happened at that point. Uh, but <laughs> Shadow, if you want to take these next two games, you're going to have to either push a little bit more on the offense or keep these these goals out. They were doing fairly well. I mean, there were a lot of last second saves, especially with Baby Northwest able to get that one from the backboard we saw earlier. Great defense, and they can keep that up into the next few games. <laughs> Reverse sweep is hard, though. We're going to have to see if they can do it. Well, I like the way that the Shadow changed their approach to everything. The Wolves really were, the Shadow were really taking control of the match in the Wolves zone. In this case, they allowed the Wolves to come to them a little bit more. And the one goal lead did allow for a little more stretching of the field there. But 
when they allowed the wolves to come to them, it really forced the wolves to stretch that defense out and they didn't have one person back the entire time. And it, that's just what it seemed like it's been almost this entire series until game three right here, because the wolves are loving their back rotation. And then the shadow, once they pulled the wolves out of their rotation, hey, they're going to pick up the pace a little bit and hit them with these counterattack goals that were lethal in game number three. Yeah, open up holes is a huge thing, able to open up two, and that's all they needed, just that they can find a few more. It took them about two minutes to do it in game number three. How long did it take this time? Well, off the kickoff, Samurai gonna take control. Nice touch, it'll be off the backboard, but nothing doing, no control there. Baby Northwest, not able to control the ball. Eric will interfere. Has a chance to do something in the corner. Both Eric and Samurai are up. Baby Northwest with a chance. It'll be a ball out for Differential. Differential going to miss out, and there's a missed opportunity early for the Shadow. Ooh, that's huge. <clears throat> Could turn that one into either a bounce off the backboard, maybe even an infield pass, or just a shot of challenging that Wolves defense. It's okay. Shake it off. You get another opportunity right here. They want to see that a lot more often, and then capitalize on them, obviously, because goals is what makes these games. So Shadow really turning up the heat in game four. Another ball lofted off of the backboard there for the Shadow. Eric now gonna control. Gets 50 50 feet away by Baby Northwest, who has a chance, but not able to get the angle he was looking for. Puts it in the corner. He is there, so is Samurai. Pushes it all the way into the opposing corner for the Shadow Differential to pick up the possession. The Wolves much more forward with their pressure right now as they are not allowing the Shadow too much time to think. And this is going to pay off if Eric can put it in. The net opportunity somehow. Differential makes the save on the second shot. This might go back the other way. Baby Northwest pushes it in. He does. No. Samurai makes a huge save at the end. How did he do that? Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think Baby Northwest was able to keep that out. That's an opportunity they don't get back too often, but oh my goodness. The slow rolling and then the no boost defender is just leaves you on pins and needles, not knowing what's going to happen. We still stay scoreless after an almost goal by the Wolves and an almost counterattack by the Shadow. Just this ping pong back and forth, but no one has broken down yet, and they're not looking to do it anytime soon. The rotation starting to really break down. Baby Northwest with a chance. Lofts it in. We'll get over. And the Shadow score first in game number four. He tried this in game three. It worked. He's like, what the heck? Let's try this again. And he does just that. This one even higher. Samurai, nowhere near it. Not expecting Bobby to ba Baby to make this one on net. And so high. So Shadow able to get in the lead in about two and a half minutes, just like last game. Hopefully it's a rewrite for them and the Wolves. Uh, looking so hot, this pressure seems to be unceasing on the black team. Yeah, Baby Northwest will keep on the pressure. Samurai will try to chuck the ball out. Doesn't do so very well. Here's Differential. Differential will get the demo. It'll alleviate a lot of pressure. Give a chance for possession in the blue zone. Nice touch and pass as Differential not able to finish it off. Eric will now see the ball out, and that is another great exhibition of pressure by the shadow yeah, differential i'm surprised he got up that fast and we're gonna shot that close i mean off the word work didn't result in a goal but those are the kind of things you need to be setting up putting on net very hard to save by the wolves and whenever you do so you're just kind of out of rotation not really have your wits with you and if you can keep putting on shots like that they're gonna break eventually they've already broken once we get a few more and solidify this win we might be looking at a game five Here's Baby Northwest. This is a high lofted ball off the backboard. He's going to get multiple touches on it, but not able to get a controlled touch towards the net. Differential, though, might get it in. And it's a pinch off the post there by Eric. Somehow makes the save. And the Wolves still able to blank the shadow after that give first goal. Man, oh, man. We've seen some crazy saves. Some our own saves, even. But... What great defense between these two teams. Eric, that was amazing. I thought for sure that was going in. Didn't think you had the boost to get back in time, and yet staying in this, the Wolves definitely are. They've got a minute to turn this around. It's a one-goal game. Anything can happen, and with the Wolves offense we've seen before, if they can turn that on like they did in game two, 
In game one, we're going to see a tied game, maybe even an overtime. We'll have to see how the shadow respond. Here's Baby Northwest. He's going to miss this shot on. Samurai taking his time. Shot. Baby Northwest. Easy save. Eric now will try to beat everybody. 2v1. Tries to loft it high. Baby Northwest barely wins that 50-50 out. The quick turn by Eric to keep it in the corner. Samurai now will try to be the one to push it out of the corner. Does so well. Eric not able to get the angle he's looking for. Differential now. 30 seconds will try to clear it out, but Eric is there. Differential continuing. Gets the cleared. Baby Northwest. Chance for the shot, and it is cleared away by Samurai. That's okay, though. Shadow just wasting time keeping the ball out of their half, out of their net, out of their box. Anything it takes, 10 seconds, and they've got the lead. Can they hold on? We saw they couldn't quite get that zero-second goal. Maybe the Wolves can get it right back at them. Samurai, ball up. One second left. We saw an amazing save by Differential, and Baby Northwest will kick it out. Shadow win game number four, and this is becoming one nutty series classy i wow these two teams have opened it up quite a bit we saw slow pace defense now all of a sudden we're seeing this fast rapid pace defense and it's ridiculous how crazy these two teams are playing against each other now the shadow the 1-0 victory there the goal differential so far between the four games one plus one for the wolves but all the momentum in the black corner for the shadow and hey what do you have to do if you're the wolves right now i mean the past two games have been a one goal differential i mean shadow got one goal and they held on the previous game they got two but you were able to make it within one get the two one but still couldn't finish it off in the end you're making it so close but it's just that hair difference that the shadow somehow putting on that this game has I, I haven't seen every game in mla but i want to say it's one of the most uh saves or at least epic saves we've seen in a game three in that one two from the wolves and one from the shadow right there at the end zero seconds differential needed to come in clutch and he did just that well done and the reverse sweep stays alive the odds and stats stacked against them and yet shadow seem to be prevailing i can say as a person with 19 saves in one series to my name this has been a crazy series for saves and that is that is a high standard for these gentlemen to live up to they are doing so extremely well as the defensive play has been off the charts the wolves known for it the shadow coming out in droves with this high octane defensive play samurai is gonna push it up baby northwest to control it out differential now we'll try to see it by samurai does so well baby northwest the pass over and it'll be chucked over to the Wolves for possession. Samurai now with a chance, and it might go all the way. Baby Northwest somehow makes the save as he sweeps across the net. My goodness, another great save. Maybe the series it has the best saves we've seen here in the Academy League on, on MLE, but still this ball is hanging out in that box, blue box a little bit too long. I, I started this game thinking, okay, Wolves, hit the reset button they know how they played in game one and game two they need to bring that out right now aggression to the utmost turn it up to 110 percent but still shadow seems to be getting lots of scoring opportunities indeed it's baby northwest gonna try to control this samurai picks it up in the mid he is he's gonna grab the boost and see it up the wall <laughs> i was thinking we might see a ceiling shot here in academy league that would be absolutely nutty instead baby northwest has a chance it'll be just wide as differential gonna keep the pressure on lofted ball off of the bar eric and samurai collide together but manage to pinch the ball clear that was huge i mean last second save from the wolves but still shadow getting shots i haven't seen yet but this one nobody and that eric able to follow it up off the backboard wolves they needed this one desperately. Didn't want a, the reverse sweep to happen, and this is how you shut it down. Consistency, and taking advantage of that double commit by the Shadows. Wolves in the lead in the first two minutes. So the advantage goes to the Wolves, and now the Shadow are gonna have to change things up just a little bit. Shadow have been playing ahead the past two games. We'll see how much the first goal being scored changes the dynamic of this series. 
Game number five, ladies and gentlemen, the Academy League. Wolves versus Shadow. Here comes Eric. Out of the mid, Baby Northwest is there. Eric gonna go with the boost star tactic there. Differential, big clear past everyone. Into the corner we go, Baby Northwest, this might drop. Eric ends up centering it, differential shot towards the net, Samurai! Big save off of the wall, somehow sprawls out and makes it. That was close, they, they don't wanna get this one tied up, keep it at a shutout, don't give Shadow any momentum at all. You got a lot of Rocket League to play. This is game five, but half of it left. Everything that's happened thus far can happen again. And Shadow still getting chances, but it can't seem to get one in. Baby Northwest will try to push something towards the net. Eric is there. Baby Northwest once again on the ball and feel like he ran himself out of boost right here, but he has no very little to defend. This is going to be dropped towards the box. Eric shot on, and it is saved by Differential. Differential now will try to clear it. Baby Northwest very far ahead of Differential. Differential gonna shoot it towards the net. Gets the second touch. It's still in the box. Baby Northwest could go, but he is low and out of boost. Missed opportunity for the Shadow as it goes back the other way in the box and Baby Northwest sweeps across. Yeah, that was a risky one. I don't know if he should have gotten up for that because if he missed, there is no one back. You fully committed with Differential there in the net and you don't definitely don't want to go down by two but every chance you get you need to at least put a shot on net and make them make the save or even tie it up if you can they got the zero second goal opportunity still alive right now if they can hold this defense here is baby northwest gonna try to control us in his box dangerous position right now the samurai gonna come in he's gonna really just womp the ball past baby northwest shot on he scores one to one with 101 on the clock there it is, tied up, one minute left, and we see Shadow looking so very close to this reverse sweep. I don't want to jinx him, so I won't talk any more about it. It's a tight, close game, close series even. One to two goal differential in every single game, and we're going to see another one just as close. This is a ball being dropped down. This is a dangerous spot, and Eric will somehow manage to make the save here. Baby Northwest will try to see it down. Samurai the back touch. Another one that might have been a little bit dangerous there. Wolves desperately needing control right now. Eric gonna put it high off the backboard. Puts a shot towards the mid. Kareen off the side of the car and wayward. That is a big shot by Deferential out of the mid. Eric sweeps across. Samurai now, another save on a shot out of the mid. That's gonna drop, Samurai off the top post. He missed the goal. Baby Northwest will try to see it away. 15 seconds left, still a chance. Differential, the clear. Samurai now, shot off the bar. Still in the box, Differential is there. The sweep away, three seconds left. Eric now will drop it and we will go to overtime. What was that? The last 20 seconds of that game, two huge opportunities off the woodwork twice. The Wolves can't seem to close it out. They still got overtime. They should shake it off. Keep that pressure up with the shadow, thinking they're lucky stars. Maybe steal this game away from the Wolves here and take the series. And that'll be it! Maybe Northwest out of the mid, and this is a beauty, my friend. As Differential sees the 50-50, takes it over Samurai, and Baby gets up fast in the box. The Shadow come from behind. They reverse sweep the Wolves. Wow. I can't believe what I just saw. I can't believe it. We talked about before uh, we were on air, and you were like, the Wolves got a powerhouse team. They've been looking great all season. I'm thinking this is going to be a 3-0 from the Wolves, and we almost saw it too. The Wolves took the first two games commandingly, I'd say a little bit. I mean, they were definitely playing uh, uh, right on top of the shadow aggression-wise. Seemed to be on top of the ball, not giving them a whole lot of opportunities. And then just that turnaround, it didn't have to be huge. It didn't have to be a blowout. The shadow was just able to get a one point, a one point, a one point win, just squeak by, but three times in a row, and they beat the odds, get the reverse sweep, and what a series. I mean, if it gets any better than this later on tonight, it's going to be amazing. But I think <laughs> oh, everyone man. watching right now has seen the best series of today.
I'm definitely the best series so far as the Shadow. Huge reverse sweep comeback, and it's amazing to think how much they took the Wolves out of their game. It just, it the early first two games, it looked like the Wolves had it in the bag, Classy, and it just, they were allowing the Shadow to do whatever they want, make mistakes, hey, take your shots, we're just gonna stay right here, we're gonna prevent you from scoring, and then, oh yeah, oops you made a mistake hey we're gonna take this open net opportunity right here yeah, yeah bye uh and, and the shadow come back they allow the wolves to pressure them a little bit more they take them out of the rotation which is something that you don't see very often it's an advanced strategy compared to what you would normally see in like academy and foundation league normally you think oh hey ball i'm gonna hit chuck ball at net net oh save sad ball all the way down oh nobody back instead, instead the shadow allow the wolves to come forward and they take them out of their defensive rotation the defensive rotation of the wolves was so slow and the shadow just allowed the wolves to come out and then they raided the den after the wolves had left yep Drawing them out, making sure that they... I mean, defense was huge. They had to keep it out in the first place because if both offenders were pushed that high, you need to make those saves just like baby Northwest. We saw him come down, make a lot of big ones. Differential right there at the end to get the win in game four and bring us to game five. And then Shadow closing it out how they needed to. Staying alive, but getting into overtime and then just that quick first like 13 seconds. Get the goal before I can even finish talking and win the reverse sweep well done to them they've punched their ticket beating the wolves in a 3-2 victory and they're going to the blue conference finals yeah they are going to the blue conference finals indeed special thanks as always to our friends at balls garana check them out balls.com i forget do we still have a promo code mle that that works for free shipping because i tell you what i was buying balls like crazy back in the day with free shipping now that, that was the thing but uh don't forget, Balls, they do sponsor our play of the week. If you see an amazing play like pretty much the entirety of this series, clip it, then, uh, you know, it could be selected for the Balls play of the week. Your favorite player, don't even have to be your favorite player, the, uh, the player who you clip could end up being your Balls Garana play of the week winner and win a freshing refreshing case of balls garana again i have the original right here tastes good so good so much energy wow and of course power a power a.com check them out for that wonderful wonderful controller action we go to break kendo slice and classy weasel calling it a night hunted and sleegy on the docket for the rest of your night we got switching back to the champions league do not go away